All right, kind of a brand new day of recording. Welcome back to more Alan Wake 2. Chubbs is behind me. He just got in his bed. He is knocked out already. It's insane how fast, like, dogs go to sleep. Anyways, everybody's doing well. Thank you for all the love and support. All the likes and everything mean a lot to me. I'm probably, like, the last person on the internet that's actually still playing this game. But I've kind of just been taking my time with it. So, anyways, let's go ahead and get this. This game has been insane. All right, here we go. Oh, we're just back here now. Okay. Scratches wakes double. He tricked us. He almost got the clicker from me. The whole plan has gone out the window. How could we get this so wrong? Textbook boondoggle. You said it, Anderson. It's a shit show. So what's the plan? Scratch pretended to be Wake to trick us. He almost won me over. I should have trusted my gut. I had a bad feeling about him when we found him at the lake. When that insane monster cloud came at me in the woods, I saw a face inside it. Wakes. I think he was always a monster. Always scratch. So he was never actually wake. Interesting. Alright, so a few things I want to just like check out. Alright, come up with a new plan. I'm guessing it has to like go with like the profiling and all that. All right, let me see. Okay, this is where we got the actual shotgun off the wall. Is there? So this is like a break room, right? Where's the shoebox at? Is there one? Let me double check the map. No, it's just a safe spot. Okay, we got new conversations, but here we go. The FBC usually handles stuff like this, right? Any thoughts? Hold up. You brought a paranatural object in here without telling me, and then almost handed it over to a hostile entity. I didn't know if I could trust you. That was a mistake. So was believing Scratch. But it's not too late. I just need to understand more. <laughs> you got that right. Let's start acting like we're on the same side, yeah? She seems very hostile for some reason. Here we go. The horror story is changing reality. It made it so my daughter died here. Even though she's supposed to be back home in Virginia. Do you know if that's... Uh... AWEs are localized distortions of reality. The area outside town might not be affected. Sometimes they expand, sometimes they fizzle out. If we can make sure it's the latter, your kid might be fine. The whole thing is a nightmare. I can't let my family be torn apart. Having family isn't easy in this line of work. The late nights, travel, alternate realities threatening their existence. My ex-wife couldn't take it. Karen, you're better off without her. I know I am. So tell me what I'm missing. The FBC must know something. Good news, we have Bureau Intel on all of this. Bad news, it's highly classified. Good news, consider yourself deputized into the Federal Bureau of Control. Here's a key to the cell where we keep the files. Happy reading. Okay. Um, thanks. Go team. Prison cell key. All right. Examine the files and lock cell. Hold on. You really don't remember Logan living in Virginia with me and David? Uh, I remember you and David having problems. You needed a break. You and Logan moved to Watery and... And then, uh... Then Logan... Oh, that awful thing happened. After you came back to work, I thought you'd be the perfect partner for this case. If you were willing to return to the area. Okay. That's enough. The story is changing your memories. What you're remembering is fiction. Logan is alive. I'm not divorced. We never moved here. I remember the truth. No, no, no. Wake or Scratch, or whoever that was, said the story could be used to attack us. We all need to question what's real. With that said, how do we know the story isn't giving you false hope? I can't convince them. I just need to change the story. All right, so now we can actually use the, uh, we got manuscript. Hold on. We got a new one? Unread. Agent Young held his clipboard up to the light. 
The equipment was all accounted for. He ticked the boxes, satisfied. A noise on the other side of the back lot made him pause. He peered into the darkness. Nothing. Shrugging, he signed and dated the form. Estevez wanted everything ready, just in case. Young appreciated a cautious leader. Estevez had held it together even after the oldest house had gone dark. Young began to head inside. The local sheriff's station was a tight fit, but at least they had a coffee machine. Young felt optimistic. They even had the para-utilitarian in custody already. Another clatter behind him. Closer this time. He turned, hand on his holster. He called out to the darkness. This station has been seized by the Federal Bureau of Control. You're not authorized to be here. Suddenly, the lights flickered, went off. Young couldn't see a thing. Then from inside the station, the screams began. All right, let's go ahead and go to the profiling now that we have Scratch on here. Man, it's crazy how we started out with the Bookers, and then it's just kind of expanded, you know? All right, what Scratch wants? Scratch was pretending to be awake, manipulating me. What does he want from me? No, I'm in control here. It's my mind place. He's powerful, too powerful. Just his presence here makes me feel sick, like a wave of terror through my head. I feel his single-minded drive to get the clicker. All right, it's only one. All right, what does it say right now? Examine the files in the locked cell. Okay. I do want to go back to the break room really quick because I want to put up you the uh, other shotgun. Much better than me. He had some dialogue too, but I'm not gonna... Hold on, where's the actual break room at? So, okay, it's down there to the other side. Okay. Try to get to the shoebox right now. I'm not gonna lie. So, going back down to the cell area... Hold on, what does this person got? I'm sorry about your brother, Elmo. Yaku was all hard. He always went along with my ideas, no matter how stupid they were. Always happy to help. I got carried away. I never think things through. It's my fault. Was there anything in here? All right, so hold on. Let me see what this also says. I realize it's a bad time. But I need you to tell me everything about the cult of the tree. The cult is my craziest idea that ever worked. <laughs> Look, what kind of a cult calls themselves a cult? Exactly. We protect watery and bright falls. We're the good guys. A secret neighborhood watch. Well, that was the idea anyways. Look, we've always known about the horror inside the lake. When any Taken come out, we kill them. You don't turn people into Taken. You kill the ones who already have. Hmm. Very interesting. How long has the cult been around for? Certain folks around here have always known about Cauldron Lake. Before us, it was the torchbearers. And when I inherited the mission, I wanted to call it a cult. <laughs> it was genius. Just a name did half the work. Made people too scared to go into the woods at night. Business 101. Fear is a great motivator. You were trying to kill Alan Wake. Why? Nothing good has ever come out of Cauldron Lake. The nightmare that hit Bright Falls in 2010 was all because of his writing. And ever since then, pages of his stories are floating up from the lake, and monsters keep popping out. It's all him, Wake. And if we don't stop him, no one will. Wake's evil doppelganger Scratch is the threat we're facing. Not Wake. And I will stop him. I've never heard of anyone called Scratch. Alright, so his dialogue options are over. And we got some stuff for the board. So, alright. What was I trying to do? Go down to the break room. Uh, so we gotta go down these steps. Alright. We gotta go this way anyways for the actual cell part, I'm pretty sure. It's been a little while. Hold on, let me make sure we're... So the cells... Hold on. No, the cells are over there. Never mind. Let me just go to the break room really quick. Try to free up some inventory space. Also, I don't want to... 
Yeah, I just don't want to have, like, too much on me. Alright, so right now we currently have... Let me go ahead and move this. The bad thing is, I don't have... Standard rifle. Man, should I bring out the rifle? We gotta get another upgrade eventually, right? Because there's, like... There's, like, ten more spots we can actually use. We just don't have them yet. Um, alright. We got a lot of handgun ammo. What in the world? Hmm. You know what? I think I'm gonna just move this over. Put that there. Let's see. I think everything else is good. I thought we had more. Hold on. I could have sworn the handgun thing said like 50. You know what I mean? Yeah, it says 3. Hold on. Standard handgun ammunition 3. It says 50. Or is it 3 and then like the max is 50? Never mind. Yeah, okay. That's the max. Got you. That wouldn't make any sense if it was the other way around. Let me go ahead, since I... Okay, I can't reload this outside of combat. Let me put this quick slot to that. So it should be the exact same thing as the other shotgun. Ah, oh, man. I'm torn to just go ahead and bring out the, uh, the rifle. I really am. I got a lot of ammo for it. Let's do it. Let's get rid of the bow and then bring out the rifle. I feel like the bow is nice, but I... I, I don't know. It, it just seems like not worth it sometimes. All right, we should have enough. So we got five spots left. All right, we're chilling. And I'll go ahead and move this to the quick slot for the bow, which is down there. So we should be good. Quick save, and we're going back. Here we go. I think it's cool. I like. I'm already like what, over ten minutes into this video, and like it's only been dialogue. You know what I mean? That's what I kind of like about this game a lot is the fact that you can pretty much do. Yeah, we're going straight. Pretty much do whatever you want, like exploring and all that. Alright, is there anything here we can actually investigate? Uh, this is the kind of case my ex hated. Not that somebody killed me. <sighs> That's funny. The cases that might kill me were my ex's favorite. This is one that was actually locked earlier. All right, here we go. The lake is a gateway to the dark place. So it's kind of like coming full circle to the beginning. When Alan Wake showed up next to the lake and everything. But it was also, maybe it's not Alan, it's just Scratch the, the entire is time. What the utilitarian? Redacted. All right. Hmm. All right, transcript of interview with subject Alan Week. Uh, let's see. Dark Presence. Feel free to pause it if you need to, by the way. I can kind of read all these when I'm... I guess just... Wait, that was another thing I collect. Wake isn't the first person the Dark Presence disguised itself as. All right, so the entire objective right now is to come up with a new plan. Uh, what I'm gonna do is get every amount of evidence I can. Let's check his cell, too. He had to have something in here, right? Nothing? Alright. <laughs> Nothing at all! Now, one guy got just absolutely collapsed on. Through the cell, too, which is insane. Alright! Case board time. First off, let's profile. Uh, we got two. We got Wake, and we got this one as well. Killing Taken. Ilmo said the cult kills Taken. Is he telling the truth? Surplus deer masks by in bulk. We've got a floater, a Taken on the shore. Call the gang Yakko. We are going hunting. Cult of the tree. Keeping the town safe since 2013. Ilmo is telling the truth about the cult. They really were fighting the Taken. We're on the same side. If the cult is killing Taken, then why did Nightingale turn into one? Private party. Invitation only. Wrong time. Wrong place. Time to go, Yako. A job half done isn't done at all. Nightingale became a Taken because the Bookers interrupted their ritual. 
Hold on, we still got more profiling though. We got one for Wake. Or maybe more than one. We'll see. Trapped in the dark place. I assumed Wake escaped the dark place. Is it possible he's still there? The big apple in an ocean of darkness. Gone diving. Note from my editor. You're using the wrong tense. Trapped in a loop. My friends will meet him when I'm gone. Wake is still trapped in the dark place. Maybe he always was. Got a lot of songs we can listen to. Here's what's funny. I saw a comment that actually said it's safe to listen to all those. And I did on one video and I had to remove it. Because it got copyright claim, which is actually insane. Uh, it is what it is, though. Doesn't, like, take away from the game. I'm just trying to avoid the music. There was that one episode... Ah, uh, what part number was it? I think it was, like, two videos ago. Or maybe three. When I first got to the nursing home, you had to, like... Uh, talk to everybody there initially before you went upstairs. The, before I went upstairs the very first time, I cut to me going up the steps. The reason I cut... It's because about a minute and a half, there was like a song playing that was one of those things on the radio, and it got claimed, which is just crazy to me. All right, here we go. <laughs> Nightingale, there we go. Very first boss of the game. Let's see, he's never heard a scratch. How is that even possible? Writing part, it wouldn't be that. Hold on. Is there one for scratch? Who's involved? Hold on. No. All right, might be time for brute force. No. Hmm. The goal, ritual, cult psychology, that wouldn't work either. Who's involved would be my first. Hold on. Never heard of scratch, so what? We're just gonna go to the list. Psychology, nothing. One of these has to work. Goal, really? That seems so odd. All right, the cult found Wake's page inside taken. Well, he was the cause. Wait, he was the the cause. What? <laughs> That's funny. All right, cult of the true targeted people already corrupted by the dark presence. Their goal was to protect the community. Hmm. Who's involved? No, it wouldn't be it. Uh... Hmm. I'm just gonna just try all these. There we go. Alright, ritual was meant to destroy Taken, not create them. Got you. Writing part of the ritual, who's involved? That would I don't think this is it. I'm gonna try it Thanks, though. Saga. No. Cult psychology? Hold on, Where, where's the one that says goals? It's gotta be that one, right? Who's involved? No. Cult psychology? It wouldn't work. Oh, I already tried that one. Symbols wouldn't work, obviously. Don't make any sense. Okay, let's go all the way over here. Nothing? Alright. Alright, so we got those. Let's see the story. This last time it didn't let me use all these. Hold on. The clicker. Okay. Light and dark presence. The overlap. The clicker. Here we go. The clicker amplifies any changes to reality suggested by a piece of art. Makes them permanent. So that's done, okay. The dark presence is vulnerable against bright light. At least that makes sense. Alright, so these are for later. Got gotcha. you. Fact versus fiction. For later as well. Hold on, the story is lit up again. Is it... All right, same thing. So it lets you at least select it, even though you can't use the stuff yet. All right, wake and the clicker. Here we go. It's brand new. Woo, here we go. Wake is trapped in the dark place. He's been reaching out, communicating with me in the overlaps. All right, let's see. I'm just going to try both of these. Okay. 
I need to know what information I can still trust. Uh, I don't think that's the right one. Gotta go over here. How to rescue Wake, yep. Through the lake, right? Hold on. So the lake is like a gateway, essentially. I didn't mean to go to the map. Hold on. Case board. Anderson Brothers. We got one, the overlap. Taurus here, in the overlap. Gotta find him and get the fuck out. Fact versus fiction. Okay, those are done. I mean, we've... I think we've already exhausted everything, right? Had to have. Okay, about the clicker. Alright, we're going to go back. I wonder if we can go back out there where the actual boss fight was. It was kind of a, like a mini boss fight. But there was some stuff out here I could loot. I just didn't uh, have a chance to because I was getting chased. I kind of let, like... The first time I do a boss fight now... I'm honestly just going to, like, let them kill me because... I waste a lot of resources sometimes just trying to, like... <laughs> just trying to, like, figure things out, you know? Hold on, what is this? This game is so good. You know what I think is awesome about this? I'm kind of happy that Alone in the Dark did not come out at the same time. It was originally going to, right? And... Oh, there's no map for this spot, really. I could have sworn I was, like, in the boss, but there was, like, a box somewhere I could loot. Like, a small little box. I guess not. But, yeah, I feel like those two games, it's like a psychological horror type thing. It would have kind of overlapped a little too much, I think. Uh... I thought it was, like, the paparazzi for a minute. I was like, what's going on here? First, I thought there were zombies. I wasn't really sure. I was like, what's going on here? Or not zombies, but taken, I guess. Let's talk to her. Hold on, let's ask him first. So, the cold of the tree actually kills taken. They were on our side, even if their methods are misguided and criminal. It looked right from where we were standing. Nothing's what it seems in this case. Too many stories contradicting each other. Too many versions of the truth. We have a lot of catching up to do after this thing is all over. Everything is different now. My family, me, the whole fucking world. I'll buy the coffee, Anderson. Partners to the end. This case is one for the books. I see what you did there. Scratch told me the clicker can be used to change the story. Does that match your understanding of this thing? Yeah, the light switch is a paranatural item, maybe even an object of power. We have verified reports that Alan Wake was in possession of it during the AWE here back in 2010. It definitely has power. We know that much. I can come up with a plan. I always do. All right, so we got to... I guess to go back to profiling, right? Now that we have her on there. Wait. I could have sworn I saw her, like, icon. Case board. Uh, hold on. Story? Nope, they're still marked off. Here we go. Wake in the clicker. How to rescue Wake. Hold on, let me zoom out. The clicker can fix this. But I can't use it without Wake. Tor knows about this stuff. Maybe he can help. All right, the Anderson brothers. We got this one. All right, Dark Presence got to Cynthia. Used her to keep Tor from me. Got you. Fact versus fiction. There's still... And then the story should be the same thing. Yeah, you can't use those yet. All right, uh, profiling. Trusting Wake. Let's go to the first one. Wake told me the clicker would fix this. But Wake was actually Scratch. How can I trust anything he said? The artist must conclude his work. He rides a storm on your piece. Wake up and smell the danger. We told you already, kiddo. What Tom said about the light switch is true. 
Don't let the story confuse you. You need him to write the ending you want. The clicker to make that ending come true. But we don't have Wake. Everything we knew about the clicker was true. He wasn't lying. Wake is still in the dark place. How do I get him out? We live and breathe rock and roll. From the silence of screams, from the fever of dreams. The clicker can amp up other works of art, not just Tom's writing. Anything created with passion. The dark power of the lake will make it creep into reality. But if the holder of the clicker believes in the art, they can make it all come true in the flick of a switch. I can use the clicker without Wake. Only Wake's writing can change the horror story. But I can use the clicker to change something else. Like getting Wake out of the dark place. Oh, my game froze for a minute. I was kind of getting scared there for a minute. I don't know the last time I actually saved it. All right. Uh, come up with a plan. So we haven't done that already? Maybe I don't have all the clues yet. Maybe those other ones actually work now. No? Fact versus fiction. Wake in the clicker. This has to be the one. I will use the clicker to change reality and bring Wake back at Cauldron Lake. I'll need the right work of art, but that won't be a problem. Alright, those are the exact same. The story is also not able to be used. Alright, I, I think we now. got this spot now. I just need to tell the others what to do and fix everything. For good. Alright, share the plan. So we need Wake to fix the story, right? That hasn't changed. So here's what I have. Wake's still trapped in the dark place, under the lake. I think we can use the clicker to get him out. But first, we need a work of art. Something other than his story. And that'll get him here. I'm not filling out the paperwork for this one. I wouldn't know where to start. But I'm sold. Okay. Look, this feels like something that once we get the ball rolling, there's no turning back. You sure you have it all figured out? Uh, it's so the beginning of the end of the game. Interesting. Save your game first. Exploring and traveling to other areas will be limited if you choose. Okay, yeah. Let's do it. Uh, I'm gonna save over this one. <laughs> that was a while back. <laughs> I feel like I've only used, like, the left and the right one. All right. I'm ready to head to Cauldron Lake now. Let's get the plan started. Okay, here we go. We'll be there for you. What do you need from us? I'll head to Cauldron Lake with the clicker. Scratch will try to get you, Anderson. You'll need backup. I can tell there's no talking you out of coming, Casey. Estevez, is there a way to get that light array to the lake? Oh, I've got you covered, so good news there. And we'll bring our mobile containment unit. It's specially built for entities like Scratch. And this work of art, Anderson. What's the plan for that? I'll make some calls on the way. Just meet me at Cauldron Lake. All right, we're good. All right, uh, perform the ritual at Cauldron Lake. Take the car, okay? So we just leave the area. I gotta admit that this game's lighting Tor? is insanely good. I need the old gods of Asgard. I need a very special song. You saw this coming, huh? Of course. I need a song about Alan Wake. About bringing him out of the dark place. Still got it. Hold on, where's the actual car at? Okay, we're going the right way. I thought I was over here. I was just like confused for a minute because it seemed like we were going the wrong way. Like everybody's just standing outside, just waiting for something to happen. <laughs> just standing out outside in the distance in the rain, just chilling. 
All right. Wait, what does that say? Uh, is this a manuscript page right here? Hold on. Uh, unread. Now, was this always in the game, the unread part? After getting his hands on the FBC files, Ilmo Koskalin knew what he was up against. He masterminded the cult, his and Yako's army, to fight the fucked up horror lurking under the lake, and a plan to keep those feds in their bunker by the lake in the dark. Outsiders would only screw things up. The Koskalis sabotaged the FPC's monitoring station and rigged it to alert them when something was brewing at the lake. One time months later, when the alarm rang, they drove to the lake again, ready for a fight. But this time, they didn't find any monsters. Something else washed ashore. The light switch. They'd read how Wake had stopped Jagger with it in the stolen files. From that point on, whenever the cult caught someone taken over by the shadow, they cut out the monster's heart, pushed the switch into the hole, and flicked it. All right, let's get going. Pick up, pick up. David, please pick up. David. David! It's me. Where have you- Stop. For once, you need to listen. You left me. You took my daughter away from me. Then you let her... She's dead because of you. And I don't ever want to hear your voice again. Stop calling me. David! Jesus Christ. It's getting worse. It's spreading. I'm running out of time. All right, get to the lake shore. I'm assuming we're just going on the same path we have before. Hold on, let me double check the map. Let's see, we're going here. It looks like, uh... So that's crossed up, so we're, we have to go this way. Okay, we gotta go, like, the long route. Go up here. Let's just follow this. We're chilling. Hold on, hold on. I need to heal up. What in the world? Might go ahead and heal up twice, just because, uh... Alright, we're maxed out. We're chilling. I got the rifle. We are... Kitted right now. We're chilling. Does it really matter which way we go? So we're like the point of no return, which is kind of weird because we're incoming with the lights, Anderson. Where do you want them? Set them up on the shore. We need to be ready if Scratch shows up. We'll be ready. Best to best out. There's no way this is like the end of the game. You know what I mean? I'm torn. It's like, I don't want to use all my ammo. I'm tempted to, like, run past the enemies. But, I don't know. I'm just going to use everything if I can. If I run out of stuff, so be it. That must be Torn Odin. Maybe I should check in. Get out! We're almost at the gig! And Odin's run over four minions of darkness! <laughs> the box is our hammer! I'm driving with one hand! I need you to meet me at the shore. Is the song ready? Almost! Odin's got a killer chorus! Come save your soul, awake new and whole. By name I will serve. Oh, tree! Tree! What tree? There's no tree in the song! Who the fuck put the tree in the middle of the road? We're not on a road. 
Drive carefully, Grandpa. Metal to the metal, bro! Metal to the metal! Yeah! <laughs> Very rock and roll way to drive. What was that noise? Let me check the map. Hold on. How close are we? We have the break room in front of us. All right. Let's go there first. I'm going to take out some, I guess, healing items. Because I got a lot, but I don't have any on me, really. I'm also going to save the game. Hold on. I'm curious about something. There's a puddle to, like, change back to wake. It would make sense to be able to, like, interact with him right now. You know what I mean? All right. Let me get rid of some of this stuff. Propane tank. Let's move that. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and use these first. I really want to, like, fix up my inventory. It's, like, driving me crazy. <laughs> the OCD is kicking in. Hold on. Move that there. I feel like it really doesn't matter where you put everything, but i just been wanting to do this. I probably should have done this before I recorded. Oh, I, oh, I almost discarded all my ammo. That ain't good. <laughs> Shouldn't be that simple. You know what I mean? Battery pack. Let's move that there. Uh, flare right there. We'll put the healing items. We'll just keep them on the bottom row. That's fine. Should I, hold on, should I double up these? Let's bring one more out. You know, like, I feel like I'm probably going to have to use one anyways if I get into a fight. So at least I can, like, use one and then have a spot on the inventory available afterwards. Alright, here we go. Let's see... Wait, so how do we get... How do we get to the actual shore area? Because if you look right now, this is blocked off. We can't go this way. That's blocked off. So... Maybe they want you to go the other... Yeah, there's only one other path, I feel like. And it's where, like... I'm assuming it's where that... Bus or van or whatever ran through here. This has to be the right way. Let me double check. Yeah, it's saying to go here. I don't know. This is like a brand new area. All right, here we go. So I was just like trying to check everything, make sure we're going the right way. So it's like it opened up a path. I don't like this because I have a feeling we're going to fight a lot of enemies down here. I feel like so far I've gotten all the different like types of guns in the game. My least favorite's the bow. I feel like that one just seems... Uh oh, hold on. I wonder if I can run past him, you know? I haven't tried it yet, but I just don't have a lot of anything. I did a lot of damage, my goodness. Okay. This thing packs a serious punch, too. Is there anything up here? It seems like you can explore a little bit more. We got, we got like, numbers. Plus two. What is this one? Like, I just saw it from a distance. From a distance. Let's say minus two. Plus two, minus two. Okay. I hope we can go up here. Plus three. Okay. Oh, Another there's a... One of those cult boxes. Wait a minute. Okay. Rock, rock, tree. Got you. You know what? Let's just say forget. No, it wouldn't make sense. You have to actually count the negatives, so you have to subtract it. So, five would be first. And then, six, eight. Five, six, eight. No other way around it, right? Five, six, eight. Hmm. Let's just try putting five here and then six there. There we go. So you just have to like reverse it around a little bit. Uh, are you one of us or one of them? 
collect everything. Actually, a lot of stuff. My goodness. It's like one of the first ones I've actually opened in this game. I could really go for some handgun ammo right now. Alright, where are we going? Uh, looks like it's cut off here. Can I hop over this? No? It's a dead end. Okay. I wonder if we can go up here and go, like, left or something. Yeah, you go around. Okay. So it's kind of like in a flow pattern, I guess. The lights in the containment cell are good to go, Anderson. Great. A Torin Ode in there yet? <laughs> the two golden oldies? Well, they're here. And they bought moonshine. I love them already. <laughs> they're a lot. You wanted to know what art we would use? Well, that's them. I'll be there soon. I tried every key I have. Bolt cutters didn't work. Sheriff keys obviously wouldn't work. Doorknob, none of that stuff. The clicker's not going to work. Trailer park key's not going to work. Screwdriver. Nice. Okay. I couldn't see anything when she did that. <laughs> it went pitch black. Okay, we actually have a lot of spots. We got some ammo at least, so let's put this on. What's my inventory look like right now? I might just get rid of the propane tank if I need to. We'll see. I haven't actually... Trying to like conserve ammo as much as I can, but... Alright, same thing as last time. It's kind of weird we got bolt cutters, but we're using a screwdriver. You know what I mean? What we got? Those enemies. Where'd it go? I don't think I missed any shots there. Uh, how are you still alive? Think we're in the clear, maybe? What's this? A crow doll? Interesting. That's something new. What is this? It's like a puzzle. Oh, okay. So, we gotta find different dolls. Got you. What does this actually say? Okay. One bird for light. Okay, do we have a bird? We have a crow, but that's not really... Something feels different. I should look around. That was a crazy, like, screen thing that just happened. So we put that down and everything felt different. Okay. Let's break these. It's kind of weird. It's like, should I go back, I wonder? If I gotta fight more enemies, I may just, uh, like, not do this. Get the dolls. Might need them again. The fact that you can only put one down at a time is kind of odd. Like, I thought maybe we'd place them all in, like, a pattern. But. It's whatever. Oh, wait. Hold on. What is that? Inventory's full? Oh, man. Uh, Let's go ahead and discard this. I don't really need it. Charm. It'll go great on the bracelet Logan made for me. Huh. Wait, what? That was strange. Gotta keep an eye out for more of these rhymes. We got another charm bracelet. We also got manuscripts. We haven't used these in a while. Uh, charm bracelet. I don't think I can actually equip that here. Unless... This lets me move it. Okay, nice. What does this one do? 
Okay, attacks stagger enemies more often. Got you. I might break out some flares here in a minute. So we interact with that one time and it just went away. Okay. All right, let's keep it moving. Testing. 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 Gonna need Crank more reverb. I'm getting no bounce on here. Bounce on here. <laughs> Man, this game has been quite the experience. It's one of those symbols again. Maybe there's a cult stash somewhere. Yeah, there is. Okay. That doesn't really help me. It's just as an arrow that way. Can I go under? Hold on. No, we're not going under that. Gotcha. Can't climb that either. What does the map look like? Uh, okay, we have to, I think we got to go do something like the dolls, maybe, and then it's going to change the path in front of us. I'm not really sure. That's my only guess right now. I could be wrong. We'll, we'll see. <laughs> hey, wait, this is the right spot. Where are my chimes? I threw them out. Chimes are not rock and roll. Yeah, hey. they are. Summoning. This will be a show for the ages. Anderson, we've set up control center up here overlooking the area. Anderson, I can drop more gear down for you if you're running low. I'll use the lights to hit the Taken when they come. Light them up for you. Bad news is, we were in a hurry. The power supply is spotty. Your partner here will try to keep it running. But I, I'm not a damn mechanic. I wish your tech guy was here, Karen. All right, so the only thing I'm thinking about right now is we're about to get ambushed probably from, like, many different directions. Is there any other ammo I can collect before we'll the actual fight starts? Maximum volume. It's like I want to use all the, like, heavy-hitting stuff I have, but at the same time, I don't think it's going to matter. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Yes. Let's go, baby. All right. We got something there. Anything else? Anything at all? Oh, these all open too. Okay. I knew I wasn't crazy. The only bad part is... Probably can't pick up everything. Just like old times, right, bro? Fighting the forces of darkness with heavy metal! Shoebox. Oh my goodness, this is such a lifesaver. Okay. I'm gonna move the first aid because... It's like I wanna use them. But it just takes up so much space. Kiddo, kiddo. We're ready to We're ready rock and roll. roll. Just say just when. Say I'm going to take that and move this over here. The quick hills, I think, are the better ones. Uh, okay, hold on. Rifle. We got pretty much everything we need. Uh, handgun. Let's We're move that to that. Up to the top. Battery pack down here. Okay, we are chilling. This should be good. Let me loot all the other things first. If there's anything else. Because you can go ahead and get started whenever you talk to them. But I want to make sure we have everything, I guess, loot-wise in this area. I don't see any of the icons like you can loot something. Uh, like a box or whatever. I think we're probably... Unless these have anything, we'll see. Nope. Okay. Alright, let's get it started. The fact that this is called summoning this is going to be sick. <laughs> get ready. Grandpa, you signal me when the song is done, and I'll use the clicker to bring Wake back. Hit it! Hello, Cauldron Wake. Great to see so many federal agents here tonight. Prepare to experience a soul-searing, mind-frying act of black magic and sorcery! This song goes out to our favorite tortured writer. Let these sweet tunes guide you out of the darkness. It's called Dark Ocean Summoning. Bad for the saga, bro. 
Uh, let's try that again. <laughs> uh. All right, survive the summoning ritual. Here we go. That was kind of cool how they messed up at the beginning. Hey, music oh, video time. A lot of paranormal crimes happening right now. It's fucking awesome. I want a t-shirt. Show's drawing a crowd. Taking incoming, Anderson. Ooh, that was so close. I'll get him in the light. I might change weapons. How much damage do they actually take? Man, Flair did some serious work. So many ads, my goodness. They just do not stop. to happen after that. This is actually kind of Insane how much is going on. There's so much. Oh my god. Nice. That was scary. <laughs> the power of rock and roll. Inventory's full, hold on.
this is used quicker. There we go. Real? So where the fuck is he? 